Hi guys and welcome to episode 4 of COVID-19 Cocktails. So tonight we are going to make a Japanese slipper and I felt it only fitting that I should wear my pajamas for this one. However, I'm not wearing slippers, not that you can see. Anyway, uh, this is one of my favorite cocktails. A word of warning, if you're going to a, um, a hotel and you go down to the bar, even if it's on their cocktail menu, just ask if they actually know how to make it because quite often it's just the normal staff that are working in the bar and they don't always know how to make it. I um, had a Japanese slipper made for me. It cost me $19 and it was um, a shot of Midori topped up with orange juice. Now, you don't even have orange juice in a Japanese slipper. You have the lemon juice. Um, it was the weirdest cocktail I've ever had. It was not very pleasant and I was not happy that I paid $19 for it. But anyway. Uh, so, in a Japanese slipper, uh, you have... Midori, you have um, either Quattro or Triple Sec. I'm using Triple Sec, it's a bit cheap. You could also use um, like a melon um, liqueur as well. You don't have to use Midori. Um, and then the other ingredient is lemon juice, which um, you can just use bottled lemon juice. I happen to have fresh today because I made a lemon meringue pie earlier today. Um, now I'm going to do, you, you do equal parts of them. Um, I'm going to do this as a double because we've had a very, very busy day today. So I've cleared our whole garden of weeds. There was literally a trail load of, um, trailer load of weeds that we took to the dump today. Um, and then I've continued on with my gardening. I think at the end of this whole, um, isolation thing, everyone is going to have awesome looking gardens because that's pretty much all we can do. Um, so anyway, I have got, um, now you can either mix this, um, just into a glass that's got ice in it and keep your ice in it, or you can do it in a, a shaker with ice. Um, I don't, I don't, sometimes I like the ice in it. Sometimes I don't. Today is one of those days that I don't. Um, but to make it easier, you can certainly just tip everything into a cup, um, and stir it up. So, all right. Um, that's the 60 mils of lemon juice. Sixty mils of triple sec or quattro. Oh, I haven't even opened this one. And 60 mils of Midori. Whoops. That's a little bit more than 60. I would probably share this with my husband too. I probably won't drink the whole thing just to myself. It's funny I don't hear him laughing. All right. So shake that up. So when you serve it, you can serve it just into a martini glass. This martini glass is a bit different to the one I had yesterday for the espresso martini because this one's a bit bigger, so it will hold a little bit more. Now, I hate this one because this one always leaks the half the drink out of it. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful green colour. Now, the decoration for this, if you wanted to, now I didn't have cherries the other night, but I went out and got some today. You just drop a cherry into the bottom and that gives us that look. Now, I like these cherries and they don't last long in the fridge, so I'm going to just pop another one, two in there because I will eat them at the end. Delicious. I've licked that now. I'll wash that. Okay, so guys, that is... A very full Japanese slipper. It it's so balanced. Like the lemon juice counteracts the sweetness of the the Midori and the um, triple set. So it's kind of you can still really taste that sourness of that lemon coming through. Really, really nice. 
Um, now, I've had a couple of requests for a few different cocktails. Um, I've got, coming up, I'll probably be doing pina colada. Um, my cousin requested a watermelon and lychee cocktail, so I will have to look that up. I, I, I don't know what that entails, but I will look it up. Um, uh, a fruit tingle, that's another one I was reminded of yesterday that I hadn't even considered. Um, and my husband's also requested a, I'm not sure what it's called, but it, it, he says it's a cocktail for men, not for women. It's, it's a man cocktail. Um, so I will probably do that one uh, next. I think it's just, it's similar to a Bloody Mary, but it's just got a bit of a different take on it. So tune in next time for that one. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.